My God, we need to get a digger with a heater in. So over the last week or so, obviously, I started on the forest area, but there's been loads and loads going on there from Nick the Tree Surgeon, and you can see all that footage on Stephanie's vlog next week sometime. But for now, I'm gonna finish it off and get it neatened up as best I can. The idea that Nick came up with is to save all these old trunks which are no good for burning, they're no good for wood because they're quite rotten and start lining the path with them and then we can use this wood chip which he's created from clearing up to spread out and just make it a nice clean edge with a defined boundary just using what's around the forest. Managed and cared for now and you know trying to get some proper paths in before we start planting and just get some structure to the place but god it's looking a lot neater I know there's still stuff there and we still got to burn this stuff actually as well but as always we're getting there sort of now as much as I've been enjoying doing these little jobs I have been kind of putting off some of the bigger jobs that I need to do and the biggest of them all is this pergola. Now it's a huge job and we all have distant memories of summertime and shirtless Amory working on this. Does he do this to you a lot Amory and should I be concerned? Yeah he does Do I need actually. to speak to your mother? Well he's the one that's rubbing the baby oil on me. Dixie's <laughs> <his> face! <laughs> <laughs> but those days are long gone and it's freezing but this job still has to be done so I'm just going to chipping away at it and see how it goes. So the next bits to go on are these bits that join from the wall to the main post which we put up earlier on in the year. And it's a bit of a faff because I've got to find the angle, get it all level. So I've got to work out one and then I've got the angles for the rest and I can start putting them up provisionally, marking everything out. That angled cut, in theory, should be the right angle to get it to, well, listen. It's very much a trial and error thing, with me anyway. So, we're going to put this one up, see how it goes. Right, well that was one up. I don't remember why I've been putting it off. So I'm going to get another one up further down and then I can run a string line between them and hopefully everything stays nice and level. That's not a one man job. So you can see I've got two in kind of opposite ends of the pergola. So I can now run a string line between them both and all the rest I can just get level and it should be nice and straight is the theory anyway. I'm gonna get a few more of these cut, ready to mount tomorrow, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Let's change the ending up a little bit today. You can watch the sunset. Bye.